And in just a few hours, Country Music's Biggest Night returns for the 49th annual CMA Awards right here on Channel 13 ABC. Chris Daniels joins me and our guest host, Todd Michelson, actually her partner in crime, too, at 102.7, <laughs> The Coyote, when she's not hanging out with Rick. They've got the lowdown on tonight's nominees. All right, now first, really quickly, debit yeah. or credit? I, I have to use uh, debit because I have kids. I never have cash, <laughs> no, you know. It's not going to hang out <laughs> no. that long. Yeah. So you were down there. You've been down there. What kind of insider information can you give us about tonight's award show? Super huge, fun stuff going on tonight. You know, this guy named Justin Timberlake, mm -hmm. he's going to be there. Why? Because he reached out to his friend Chris Stapleton, who's kind of a favorite among a lot of the insiders. The guy's an incredible musician, incredible songwriter, and he said, I will go on there as long as there's no restrictions uh, as far as timeline. Uh -huh. So it's gonna be what, like eight minutes? Yeah. Wow. Eight minutes of JT, you know, hopefully doing some dance news. And, and you know, there's been rumors that, is he doing country? Really? I don't yeah. know. But well, start yeah. out on a TV show that's hosting Country Music's Biggest Night. Well, he, you know, he has really survived I mean, from the whole boy band thing and yes. really come along and, and become actually a very elegant performer right. in his own right. So, yeah, yeah brand He's funny. Mm -hmm. All right, well, let's go over some of the nominees and see who is up. Let's start with uh, Entertainer of the Year. That is the most coveted uh, award. Now, you see Garth Brooks, Luke Bryan, Kenny Chesney, uh, Eric Church. And Miranda. Now, if I had to narrow it down, I would say Eric, Luke, or Garth. And the reason I say Garth is Garth hasn't toured in, what, 20 years? I was going to say, how did he, when I saw that, how did he even make the list? It's not like because he's done, like, a lot of music recently. He's selling everything out. Oh, so I it's just it's saw his performance. Him. Yeah, he just went back to Phoenix and performed several shows. I saw him in Phoenix, and it was 1996 as a kid all over again. Wow. So I kind of wonder, do you think he can walk away with that? What do you think? Uh, I, this is, like she said, I think this is, this is definitely the most coveted category. Mm -hmm. But I'm going to disagree. I'm going to go with Luke Bryan once again. He's I, the yeah, reigning entertainer of the year. I agree with you. And I, j yeah. I just think he's going to edge him out. But yeah. Well, no, and that's what I'm saying. Luke Bryan could, if, if it's going to be anyone, it's going to be, if it's not Garth, it's going to be Luke or Eric. Well, uh, but you make a good point. This entertainer of the year translate into actual selling and touring. Right. Yeah, mm -hmm. so. Yeah, and he's selling out everything. He hasn't had a, a song out in how long, and he's still selling out. Wow. Phoenix, like six yeah. nights in a row. Yeah, I mean. My, he's my baby. I yeah. Really good <laughs> All right, now let's talk about female vocalist of the year. This is another tough one. It's going to be a tough one because it's, you know, Miranda and Carrie are usually the ones that are really up for it. But you've got Kelsey Ballerini. She's got dibs on it. She's got dibs yeah. on it, yeah. And yeah. then, you know, a lot of people like Casey Musgraves. Yeah. But I don't know. I, I, I like them all, so it's hard to say, but it will be one of those four. See, I, I'm putting my money on Carrie Underwood. I, yeah. I would agree yeah. with yeah. you. Especially yeah. with her new album mm -hmm. that mm -hmm. came out. She just had a baby, right. and she's returning yeah. back. She's, she's had three big hits good. this year. Yeah. Strong vocalist, yeah. and she's well-liked. Yeah, yeah. yeah. she yeah. gets a lot of play on the Coyotes. Mm -hmm. so. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, she right. hit, puts out hits. Yeah, exactly. And now male vocalist of the year. Male vocalist of the year, you know, uh, Luke Bryan keeps putting out hits, Blake Shelton, Eric Church, but Dirk Spindley hasn't won it. So there's a lot of people that want Dirk Spindley. Now, if you go for the safe bet, yeah, it's going to be a Luke or, or Blake. Uh, yeah, it's going to be Blake. Um, but that Chris Stapleton, he's the wild card. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, I don't really hear a lot of him no on the Coyote. No one knows him yeah. as much yet, but he's a wild card that a lot of people in the industry want to vote for. Yeah. Really? So he may not win male vocalist because he's so new, mm -hmm. but it would, you know, you can never go wrong with Luke Bryan or Blake. So now, who are you guys most uh, excited about seeing perform tonight? Hank Jr. Hank Jr. Hank Jr. and Eric Church, they're going to open. Uh, Bo you can't go wrong with Bo Seifert. This is so true. Yeah. I heard the song. It's <laughs> phenomenal. Yeah. So yeah. it's all country. So. Todd. Zach Brown's going to perform tonight. Yeah. Uh, Sam Hunt is going to perform tonight. And, yeah. uh, you know, one of the categories that we didn't mention is new artist of the year. Now, this <laughs> one, I think, is one of the tightest races because mm -hmm. you've got five really strong artists right. in this category. And, boy, that's a tough one right there. Uh, Sam. Sam Hunt. Mm -hmm. Maddie right. and Tay. Right. Thomas Rhett, yep. Kelsey Ballerini, and then yeah. Chris Stapleton once again. Right. Mm -hmm. I think yeah. the album of the year might go to Stapleton. Yeah. It may be because yeah. a lot of people are saying, oh, possible Grammy. Well, uh, Tyler, our, our producer, is saying on our ear, apparently you and Garth are like this. Oh, well, I don't know if we're like that, <laughs> but... 
Yeah, how cool is that? Yeah, look at that. Wow. Oh, I'm wearing the same shirt. Great. That was great planning. <laughs> no. no, she has two. Yeah. What? Yes. Two. Two so the same. He's such a big star, but he's all I so ever nice. hear is that he's just, yeah, the nicest guy on the planet. And he remembered yeah. my father from all the years ago in Phoenix. And him and Trisha, we were talking recipes. We were talking about biscuits and gravy. And I was telling him how to make tamales and enchiladas. <laughs> oh, wow. And then he was telling me he was hungry. And I said, you are more than welcome to come to my house, and I will cook for you anytime. <laughs> he said, I'll be there. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Well, the uh, Country Music Awards 2015, hosted by Brad Paisley and Carrie Underwood for the eighth time tonight at 8 o'clock right here on Channel 13. Still to come, a parachute goes up in flames as the skydiver was going down. See what happened. And next, Tiger Woods' former caddy tees off on his old...